So I'm going to do a quick tutorial on how to reconstitute HCG, human chorionic gonadotropin, and it's really quite simple. In this case, we have a 12,000 IU vial of HCG, and then we also have bacteria static water. Typically, the bacteria static water comes in the package from the pharmacy with the, the lyophilized powders. So all you're going to need are those two, a 10cc, 5cc, whatever you're going to be using to reconstitute, and then a bigger needle, bigger gauge. In this case, it's going to be an 18 gauge needle, one inch. So what we need to do, pop our top off our HCG. Always good to have a, an alcohol swab. Take that off. Since this is probably already sterile, but it's always better to be safe. Clean the top of this vial. Remove the top from our bacteriostatic water. Now remove our reconstitution big syringe. And in this case, the instructions are to reconstitute 12,000 IUs with six mils of water. So now we open the needle, twist it on, the lure lock, draw back the fluid to the desired reconstitution. So that's six mils in this case. Remove your cap. Inject it into the plunger in the bacteriostatic water vial. Inject the air. Invert. Until you get your desired amount of bacteriostatic water. Still got a little bit of air in there. Make sure the dose is correct. All right. Invert. Now what we will do is all we have to do is inject this into our vial of HCG. And you can see because there was a vacuum in there, it immediately drew that in there. So that's done. Now what we'll do is just gently swirl the HCG. And this will want to be, you'll want to store this in the fridge. So now for protocol for maintaining fertility, typically what we do is about 500 IUs twice a week. Uh, you could do a little bit less if you are trying to prevent testicular atrophy or also maintain seminal volume. But in this case, a good balance for maintaining fertility is 500 IUs twice a week. So in this con reconstitution, that's going to be 0.25 or 25 units twice per week. So I hope that was helpful. Very straightforward. And now you're ready to inject.